How's it going viewers? Thank you guys for watching this video. In this video I will be powering up and turning on the LG G4, kind of activating it just to get it up, getting it through all the steps. So first thing that we want to do is go to the back here and go to the power button which is the one here in the middle and just go ahead and press and hold it. There's a little bit of a vibration and then the LG G4 starts to power on. I had to put the battery in first before I got got this video um, started, but you're gonna have to take the battery out of the package, put it in the back of the phone. The back of the phone comes apart through this little notch. Take this notch and you pull it back, and then you can place the battery in there. This is a Verizon phone, as you guys can tell. We'll let it do its little process startup. It says Android is starting. So it's just it says optimizing app six of twenty one. There's twenty one apps. Looks like to start with. Uh, this may take longer depending on apps. Please do not remove the battery until complete. I'm just gonna go ahead and let that load all of them up. And there we have it. Just took took about a minute. I'm um, just kind of load this page. Get all the apps up. And as you guys are able to tell, on the LG there are no buttons like on other Androids where there's the back button, this button. There will be it on the actual board itself. So here we are, the startup wizard. Select your language, English. And go ahead, do English. And please wait while we activate your new phone. This may take up to five minutes. Um, this may might take a while. I'm just going to go ahead and pause my video. And here we go. Finally, it took us to this screen. It says, sorry, we're having trouble actually activating your phone. Please call this number. Um, I'm not going to be activating it onto my line quite yet. I'm just going to go ahead and hit use Wi-Fi. And then hit next. It's going to be asking for my internet. I'm going to go ahead and select it. And I'm going to go ahead and type the password in. So now that I have my password in, I'm just going to go ahead and hit connect. It's obtaining the IP address, it's connected. So then I will go ahead, hit skip. No, it just pretty much says, okay, not skip, wait till it says next. So we're here at next. It's gonna ask if you wanna set up an email account. I don't, so I'm gonna go ahead, skip that. And this can take up to two minutes checking connection. We will wait. Okay, so here we go. Tap and go. I'm just going to go ahead and skip that. Sign in to get the most out of your device. I'm going to go ahead and skip that as well. Skip. Ask for a name. Skip that. Set screen lock now. Skip. Skip anyway. And this kind of says I didn't set the cloud up, didn't set up email, didn't set up my Google account, and I just set the English, the language to English. And there we have it. We are here on the home screen. And this is what the home screen on the LG G4 looks like. 
pages for apps, widgets, stuff like that. So that's what we have. There's a circle button, takes you home. It takes you to your recent apps, the square. Circle takes you home. The back button takes you back. If you were to open the internet browser, search for something back. So that is that. That is what your LG G4 will look like if you were to get one. Thank you guys for watching this startup video. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, go ahead and put them in the comment section below. Um, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Have a nice day.